What's your name? My name is Earth. My name is Diamond Us, and as you heard me, I'm made of diamonds. And I also have three diamond moons and diamond rings. I see. Very interesting. Oh, the names. Diamond S. Fart Emeraldo. Altasri Penis. Stop calling me Altasru Penis. I am Altasru Penis. If you again name me such like this, I will- Sorry, Altasru Penis. All right, your royal majesty, come yum, can you please try our potato? No, I don't want it. Come on, Hello. it's yummy. Hello. <laughs> your potato is so disgusting. What are you doing? Are you f***ing nuts? Go the f*** away! <laughs> Alpha's Ruby Nuts, why did you insult these little creatures from the Earth moon? I really feel sorry for them. I don't give a f*** to them. The stupid naughty idiot stuck to me by himself and tried to eat me. So he deserved it. Why did you say that? They are so helpless, but you are so heartless and toxic. I am not happy with you anymore. Astrodotic, what do you think about this new diamond planet? Um, I find it very expensive which is able to cover all the world's debts. My kid said that it's very beautiful and Nick said that he would like to get there. Um, how old is Nick? He is 14. I'm um, sorry, but my nerds don't have permissions to go to space. I have already said it to him. You stupid buddy idiots, I want to eat that big candy in the sky. What are you saying? You can't eat it. Hey, you, let me out. Or I will detonate your kingdom. <laughs> By the way, our scientists from Roscosmos and Nars want to make the moon habitable for us, but we are afraid that your camions may die due to the appearance of oxygen and changes in the moon's atmosphere and environment, so we need one of your camions for experiments. No, I won't give you any one from us. Calm down, here more candy. Okay, I'll give you one of my camions I don't mind. But if it dies, then... Alright, you little Kamnyam, welcome to our family, we will name you Raspberry. Yes, you will later meet my two kids Timmy and Nick. Alright, goodbye y'all little Kamnamis. Goodbye Earthling, goodbye. And I am again reminding y'all, please don't let Raspberry die, or we will all die too. Okay, we will keep your promise, goodbye. Goodbye. According to my AI calculations, Diamond Us has diamond plains, emerald forests, golden beaches, lapis oceans, iron mountains and breathable atmosphere, so you can safely walk here without spacesuits. I don't believe this nervy robot. If I come out and die, I will- USA, come out. NASA bot did not lie to us. <sighs> ah, breathe air! Alright Switzerland, we wanted to mine diamonds here secretly from Russia, so we can become the richest countries on Earth. Yes, but NASA told us on United Nations meeting that this planet is very fragile because of its core, so if something goes wrong, the planet will explode and all the diamond shards will fall on the Earth and cause the end of the world. Um, how to do this cleverly? We need to process this question. I just realized that there are already chipped diamond pieces here and this is the only way to benefit. Oh, I have an idea. Who the hell are these stupid nut idiots? I don't know, but I heard from far away that they want to obtain our diamonds.
I'm announcing a new competition to collect diamonds on the planet Diamond Ass. And whoever collects them the most will win 250,000 tons of TNT. Oh, pardon? Oil. Yes, finally we will no longer be poor. Ello Games, Tora y Will participate in a Diamond Collecting Competition. G. Guys, I suspect that our new friends may exploit us for their own good. Yes, I have seen that the Earthlings are constantly exploiting the Earth and using its resources. And they also took those little creatures from the Earth Moon into slavery and are using them for experiments. Hey you diamond ass, have these stupid naughty Earthlings been on you? Um, yes, they have been on me. But what are the questions, my little moons? We cannot trust them and you must isolate from them because we don't know what they want to do to us. We will see what they want to do to us, and in an emergency case we will apply the same way which we had applied last time. No, because of that we lost our brother and sister. We won't risk our lives for defending you. We still feel sad after death of our own gold and violet amethyst. Listen, I'll decide by myself what we'll do. We're offended by you, go to ass. I'm sorry, I overheard your conversation. You had brother and sister. It doesn't f***ing concern you. Get the f*** out of here. Don't be so aggressive. I think it's better to tell him. I have an entire story to tell you, Earth Moon. Sorry, but my name is Selena. And I don't like when anyone calls me Earth Moon. Okay, Selena. Now listen to our story. So, two billion years ago... Oh, I'm so bored. I feel sad after that civilization destroyed our star, Lumra. And we are now lonely drifting through dark and cold space. Holy f***, will another civilization attack happen again? <laughs> You both are the biggest and the strongest ones. This is the only way to get rid of these aliens. But you both must become kamikazes now. No, I don't want them to die. Sorry, but it's better that we both sacrifice our lives than that we all die. Do you all want to live or not? Alright, we'll have to lose you then. Goodbye forever. Goodbye. This chaos caused our village to burn down, and now our villagers are dying. <laughs> They sacrificed themselves to save us. Suck a heroic deed. Rest in peace, Laura Gold and Violet Amethyst. You will be always remembered in our hearts. <laughs> it was such a sad and heartbreaking story. I feel your pain. Me too. Four and a half billion years ago, when I was very young, I was uninhabitable and I did not have any moons. But one day a planet called Thea crashed into me. I was in so much pain. Yes, I also was in so much pain when I was born from Thea's debris. 
We were so shocked and did not understand anything, but later we recovered from the shock and became friends. But the soul of Faye. Oh my god! Hey, you get the fing f out of here. I don't give a f. I want to visit Diamond Danis. We don't trust you. If you visit our planet, I will crash into your Earth. Oh, we can use the power of the new star to send the Earthling away. Again, this stupid naughty Ching Shang Hanji. Man, it turns out the new sun can die too. Yes, and if it does, then we will die. So to survive, we must feed it one of the moons of Diamond Us. No, if we do this, these moons will crash into the earth. I know what to do. We must use those diamond pieces on Diamond Us to build new moon. Alright, we will build a new moon. According to my AI calculations, if you feed diamonds to Junat Turnus, it will explode- SHUT THE F*** UP YOU STUPID NAZI IDIOT! A. <laughs> this China is so fucking weird. Guys, it turns out that all the collected diamonds will not go into your pockets, but to create a new diamond moon so that the new sun doesn't kill us because it needs resources. Disgraceful! Disgraceful! But there are so many diamonds that we can build many moons, and we just need time. Maybe we can just build one huge moon. Daddy, we have played enough. I want pizza. Yeah, I want pepperoni. Alright, let's go to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Hello Astro Penis, I want you to make a cannon that will pull all the diamonds toward it. We want to create new diamond moon. Aru here, Aru Aru, stop calling me Astro Penis. My name is- Nobody f***ing cares Penis, dude. Go to work Stop right swearing, there are kids next to me. You shut the f*** up! What is nobody f***ing cares Penis, dude? It's what uncultured USA allows himself to say, but you are only six years old to know this. Okay, I will know. You f***ed me up. I wanted to feed my kids with pizza. I don't give a f They can do without pizza. And you go fly to space and take a capybara so you don't get bored. Yes, and please make a new moon. Okay. I'm so f***ing sick of USA. I wanna f***ing quit my job and spend most of my time with wife and kids. Stupid naughty earthlings are so selfish that they are harming to others. Oh, I am finally feeling better after this stuff again. These earthlings are so dangerous, so I must wipe out them all. Stop! Listen, Altas Rupinus. My if name you is dare, I don't give a f if you dare to crash into the earth, I will crash into Diamond Ass. I'm much bigger and stronger than you, so I can cause more mess than you. Sorry, Mr. Fia. I wish you the best. Goodbye. We are happy. We are more happy. Tell me immediately, where is Raspberry? If it's dead, I will press this button that will make a move. 
sorry, but as the almost died during experiments, he fell into a coma and we barely saved him. Tell me now, what have you done with him? Unfortunately, your species cannot survive in an oxygen environment and under atmospheric pressure. I am telling it again. If he dies, then your birth is doomed. This time they were saved from the fate of cosmic destruction. They were able to come to an agreement with another race and avoided the catastrophe of destruction due to another planet. I think this universe is one of the few that could survive. Everyone is alive! Happy end! By studying genetic memory of diamonds, we found out that Diamondus was attacked by a civilization 2 billion years ago. According to my calculations, Diamondus is attacked by alien civilizations every 2 billion years. Based on this, there will be a war in one year, and we must spend all our time preparation for the next attack. <laughs> Hello Russia, so as you asked me, this is how the fighters look like. I see. We must develop a special armor that can resist these fighters' bullets. We must design and construct modern fighters which will be able to fight against the alien fighters. Yes. 